Mr. Matt gives uh, gave his year 10 blue uh, class uh, a class test on measurement which was marked out of 50. He organized the result in the into the following frequency table uh, below, and uh, you need to uh, we need to do two things. One is displayed on the histogram, and then tell what does the histogram tell. So let me talk about the table. So here you have got marks out of 50 and frequency. What does this mean? Mm, there were three students who got marks between 1 to 10, six students who got marks between 11 to 20 and so on. Now marks is out of 50. Now marks is a continuous data. So you can get uh, say 10.5 marks or 10 and a quarter marks. Okay, it doesn't necessarily be a whole number. You can get out of marks which can be as a decimal. So here the big question is what if a student has got say where would be a student who has got 10.5 marks or where is the student who has got say 20.6 marks. So here you have to read the this means this one is include this is it's from 1 to 10 means this 10 means this is up to 10.999 10.999 so all the students who have got marks between say 1 to 10.999 is in this class this starts from 11 okay so this is up to 20.999 okay and so on so this is up to the uh, this 20 means this is up to 20.999 and this and this class starts from 21 so this is where it starts and it ends at 10.999 okay and so on okay so yeah as it's a continuous data you had to draw a histogram okay so I've already drawn the histogram it looks like this so on the x-axis so this is always on the x-axis you take the first uh, uh, information and on the y-axis you take the second information so what does this t uh, histogram tell there were three students who got marks between 1 to 10.999 so this is let me write three here there were six students who got marks between 11 to 20.999 and that's why this is joined okay so all the students who got marks between 1 to 10.999 okay uh, is in this group so there were 12 students who got marks between 21 to 30.999 and so on so this is 8 and this is 3 so this is very simple so now we need to talk about the second question is what does the histogram tell you about the results see his drawing histogram is not difficult but to read the histogram and make sense is what is important. So what is that you can see? There is a maximum number of students, so let me write it, type it so that you can see. Okay, so let me type like this. What, so what is that you can see? The most common, the most common mark range is what 21 to 30 21 to 30 that's the most common range uh, okay what the remaining the remaining marks are spread out evenly on both sides or either sides of the range 21 to 30. So what does that mean? So from this you can say so the average or mean marks obtained by the students of year 10 blue 
should be should should be around 25 marks out of 50 so you can make an estimate the histogram tells us as most of the students are between 21 to 30 and as there is almost evenly spread on both the sides the average which is a mean should be between 21 to 30 which is about around 25 